Hello, anyone and everyone. Welcome to Etrop Blades Vampire Survivors. I know you don't hear a lot of that right now. Well, maybe it is. Press this. I'm pressing the start. All right, okay. Uh, no music right now. There's a little music at the start. Anyways, Vampire Survivors mow thousands of night creatures and survive until dawn. Vampire Survivors is a gothic horror casual game with roguelike elements. Where your choices can allow you to quickly snowball against hundreds of monsters that get thrown at you. Price two ninety nine US dollars. Developed by Ponko. Published by Ponko. Release date December seventeenth, twenty twenty one. Let's jump into this. I hope it's not too loud. We're gonna play as our favorite character, Antonio, obviously. Yeah. So I saw this game and put it on my wish list, and I was like, you know, no rush. I'll pick this up on payday, which I know it's two ninety nine. Well, you're breaking the payday. You know, I just decided it wasn't be a rush. How do we? Hold on. Should I be playing this as a controller? Is that the move? Probably just doing... Okay, we're not playing that with the controller. We, we figured that out really fast. Oh, I'm just auto sh attacking. It's a joystick. Oh, okay, okay. Is this, like, is this just like a phone game? It's alright. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, we're big brain this. Who are them in here? Throw me the idol, throw me the idol, and I'll throw you the whip. Psych, I am the whip. Give me my mana. I need to level up, please. I would like to gain my experience modifier. Oh, okay, that was loud. That was kind of louder than I thought it would be. I'm gonna turn it down. It was, it might, not, might not been that loud to you because I always put the desktop audio lower than what I hear, but Jesus. Uh, yeah. Magic wand, axe, high damage, higher suit, knife fires, quickly in the face direction. This is nearest end. Let's just be a big axe wing it. Oh, no, they're eating me. Where, where's my axe mode, though? Oh, he just chucks an axe. I'm about it. Oh, he just throws it. Oh. He throws it up, no matter what. And it comes down. I didn't. No, I, I, th I was really hoping he'd just do a big, like, swing or flee. Okay, Jesus Christ. Generate damaging zones, Santa water. Okay, you like that. Orbiting King Bible orbits around the character, shields from damage when active. The King Bible. King Bible, I, I call upon thee. Oh, there's the King Bible. Oh, it's only... Okay, 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 okay. I got you. The King Bible is... I don't know, King Bible doesn't feel like it. Oh, I forgot, I can just hit him all above me. Alright, we're gonna get these gems. We're gonna keep moving. I can probably just play this non-stop. I, I kinda wish this was a phone game, realistically. It probably is. I don't know. I didn't really do my research. So essentially the vibe of this game was, I was I probably started the anecdote then got distracted halfway through and started playing. But as I do all the time in real life and probably in all my videos. But... Uh, ah! <laughs> essentially I saw the game, was excited to get it. Oh my god! I uh, decided to put it on my wish list as a watch later type of thing. Or as a buy later, I'll pay to you, know, I didn't want to break the bank. Yeah, I said all that. Come on, fires more, one more projectile. Let's generate damaging zones. That horde of bats is gonna come our way again. Oh, Cooper, you're right. I hear my dog <laughs> in the back. Sometimes he does that, and it makes me concerned. Oh, wait, an item. See, I got distracted by my, the gameplay again. That's exciting. Take this moment, uh, open. Oh, what the hell? Did I press anything? What is it? The price is right? This is dopamine. What does this mean? I already have I already have one. What does this... Yes. Oh, fires one more. Alright, cool. I didn't get the read that because I was spamming things. Fires one more projectile. Let's get another axe. Alright, okay, so I have two of the bottle and level two of the axe. Oh, God. I'm getting eaten. It's not good. Uh... And I, like essentially I saw one YouTuber upload a video about it and I was like, you know, it's not that big of a deal. But then like, he always uploads things right off the bat. He's, all he does is do that. that every day he uploads a new video of a new game. 
which is what I wish I could do, but uh, essentially then I, I wait a week and a bunch of YouTubers I actually watch all the time are playing it and I'm like, dang it. The hype train's already here. There's no way I'm gonna get YouTube views from any random viewers now. Oh, that car. Let's do that. But it is what it is. I am joining this game actually immensely. It's very simple minded. Uh, it. A lot of YouTubers were saying, uh, and I love you. I know, like Northern Line was saying, the next Snake RX energy, and I could feel that. Snake RX, if you didn't know, is an amazing game. Snackers, you're a bowman. I like how some of the, I like how the bowman. Oh, that guy's like karate. <laughs> I didn't realize there was kung fu guys. I like the bowman ones because all they do is like walk at you with a bow. Hey, I'm gonna grab all this and try to level up as fast as possible. Don't you mean the, isn't that the point of the game? Shut up. Ooh, spinach. Oh, ghost. Oh, the bat horde. Oh, those spearmen are strong. We have room for two more abilities. Two more in the top left. You can clearly see that. It's room for two more abilities. Oh, the XP Fiesta. Knife. Increases axe damage, base damage, or let's get the new ability, the knife. Oh, that's actually like where I'm aiming it. I thought it was like where my character is facing, like the whip. Oh, speaking of whip. What the hey? Wait, is that a ring of plants? I must break the enemy line? I have to break the enemy line? I have to break the enemy. Oh no, it's happening. Are you. There's a break in the line, there's a break in the line, there's a break in the line, I gotta go. Hey, this is a uh, no longer... I guess I survived the vampires? Is that why it's called Vampire Survivor? <laughs> All base damage up. Eat our spinach. What is that pouch? Don't know what that is. So what happened to all those plants that I dodged? Did they just disappear upon themselves? I also realized I'm not killing any of these guys, I think. I'm just hitting them. Alright, there's some kills. There's some kills. Oh, a chest. Let me get some food. Hit them with this power. Kite them through the flames. Oh, look. There's some more zombies. They're probably way higher level than the previous zombies. All right, there's a bat horde coming. God bless a Bible and 79 gold. I'll take it. One level two king rival. Oh my God. Uh, increased armor, base damage. Up. No, there's more damage. Alright, we need to hurt these guys. We need to hurt these guys. <laughs> oh, four leaf clover. Should I be breaking these the whole time? Oh, that's a pouch of XP. All right, we're gonna bring a whole horde through the fire. I just wish I could direct my uh, through the fire and through the flames a little bit better. So I wonder, does each character only have a total of six spells? And then you just unlock them as you go? Because I'm sure, I, I know there's more spells. I wanna hit the, oh yeah, that felt good. Oh, okay, that felt less good. 
I don't know. Oh no, the bats are on me. The bats are stronger than before. The bats are stronger than before. I wasn't ready. I thought that. I thought I was a. Okay. Unlock the fire wand. So there's more spells. Find a little clover. Unlock clover. Unlocked empty toe. Okay, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we got one more. Let me see. Wings. Okay, I can fly, or am I just fast? Done. There we go. We run it back, right? Power up. What is this? Oh, and I can just bring this up. Bring this at the start. Mount fires one more. All weapons. Oh my. All right. So there's a thing. Oh yeah, that's how you can get your stuff at the start. I will play this game again. Antonio Bill Passe. Attacks do some more damage every 10 levels, max 50%. So every. Oh, you can just click and drag move. Alright. I mean, I guess that's the point of using the joystick, right? Alright. The joystick's always there, right? Didn't it say show joystick? Implying the joystick's always there. I should move my mouse off the screen. I'm sorry. I get it here, Bishop. Um, ah! Heavy damage. We like the fireballs. I I do like this a lot. Those plus like level three spinach will be really cooking. I'm Mama Mia. That's a lot. Yeah, I shot three projectiles. God, that's loud. Are we gonna get two whips? No, wait. Since when did it shoot in both directions? Did I just never notice that? I was hoping to whip both of them at the same time. That was the energy I was looking for. I want them to gather up more. Gather up so I could give them the old whip a do. Yeah, this 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 shielded one. Oh, the shielded one's always the one with the chest. Level two fire one ninety seven gold. You take that easy. Done. Oh, that was a red thing. Reduce weapon cooldowns by eight percent. Screw health. Screw. I want luck. Like, I mean, like, health? <laughs> oh, Lux crit? Oh, nobody told me it's crit. Oh, no, that's not crit. Oh, my goodness. Hey. More luck. That was just the fireball just doing gross damage. Hey. Ah, it hurts so much. We need to not do that, me. He says doing it all the time to himself because he's an idiot. Why would you shoot the fireball in that direction? I hate you. We get we just, we, just, we get some uh, better shots at like the people that are closest to us. I mean, I guess I know it's random, so I I shouldn't complain. But come on, come on, dice. Roll in the right direction for me. Oh man, I just had like a panic attack. I just remembered when like the horrible, horrible. Oh no. Hogman's max health. Let's get some more DPS out there. Yeah, run them through that. Oh, it's already gone. I 
I was really hoping to get some health there. Can we get some health? Hmm, no, but we got, we got fireballs. Oh, yeah, the skeleton army is closing in on us because there's no longer bats. I remember. And there should be a good chunk of, uh, yes. My experience in garden. Yeah, that's actually 100% what we needed. God bless. Oh, wait, there's a, there's a chest bat. Yeah, you're gonna get him. Uh, fire zone base area up to the fire burn. Reduce income damage by one. We really need something to help us with this uh, not getting killed. He says, ignoring that. The ghosts are coming. Where's the spinach at? Actually. Want to buy spinach. Popeye the sailor I am. I am's what I am's. Popeye the sailor I am's. Alright. The ghost horde is scary. But it was not as scary as the plant horde. Because the plant horde just showed up in a ring. Hmm, wow. Fire wand. Again, level 3 fire one. It'd be faster. Faster and more damage. Still random. We're up to 509 enemies. I am not the bullet hell yet. This is a game that's being advertised as you become the bullet hell. And I do feel that, but we're not the bullet. I mean, I guess you're still... If it was one... Oh, fuck. The... Oh, no, the plant armada. I hate this. I hate this. Oh yeah, that's how you get through because they uh, they create openings for you. Oh, spinach! <laughs> I couldn't get through in time. I think that's a good spot to cut it. The videos have been long recently, ladies and gentlemen. This was Etrop plays Vampire Survivors, a what's it called? A a horror survival game, ro roguelike or with roguelike elements, where you become the bullet hell. A very fun game. It's two ninety nine. You might as well grab it. Like, comment, subscribe, all that nonsense. Let me know if you pick it up. Bye bye. This thing's called riding the bull.